What we call love is really the act of patient attention. I think love often is caring enough to see how someone else experiences life, to spend time in their shoes and less in your own, to understand what other people yearn for and are frightened of and what causes them to be like they are in the world, to understand other people's pain and confusion and trauma. Maybe that is a definition of love that we need to press refresh on. And my job isn't to swoop in as the hero with the right medicine, the right fix. I think often our job in expression of love is to just simply stay in the room as we observe these things in each other without judgment, without this pressing need to fix somebody.